It's time for baseball now as the show's tour of the minors continues with a stop in the Southern League. Tonight we've got a good matchup in store between the Chattanooga Lookouts and the Rocket City Trash Pandas. Digging in, T.J. Friedel, and we are set for baseball here this evening. The 1-1 one, one home. Trying to bunt his way on base here, but this will roll foul. The 1-2. Swing and a miss got him reaching. Up with it, Kruger. And the throw is there to record the first down. At the plate, Jose Garcia comes in after a day of rest yesterday, so we'll see if it did him any good. And he lays off a pitch outside as they draw even at two and two. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. Into the box, Reese Hines. He's three for seven in the series coming in. Swing and a ball line down in the left field corner. But this is going to get foul. Coming down in buckets. Cats and dogs. Insert metaphor. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three. And that will retire the side. In now, Zane Gerwitz. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Line. That's a base hit. Around first, digging for two. And he will coast into second with a leadoff double. At the plate now, Roberto Baldacchini. Now a swing and a fly ball. But this will land untouched. Well, you don't need us to tell you. It's really starting to come down out there. I can't imagine the umpires will let this go too much longer if it doesn't ease up. Well, you could say that again, Matt. It's raining cats and dogs out there. Make sure you don't step in a poodle. I think it's time to get the grounds crew out. Hoping to send him packing. Pitch on its way. And here's a ball hit in the air. But this will land untouched. The 1-2. Hit hard down the right field line. But that's a foul ball. He's set and the one two pitch. Hit hard up the middle. And that is through into center field. A base hit. And not in time as the run scores. Into the box, Bo Way. Down low, two balls and a strike. Waldo King gets his lead at first, nobody out. In there, and it's even now, two and two. Great job of doubling up with a fastball inside. A lot of times you'll see a pitcher go in there, but they won't go back in there a second time. This guy's not afraid to pitch inside. Three and two pitch. This one's down to third. Fielded cleanly. The third baseman. Into the box now. Jordan Zimmerman. Hit the target, but this is low. Two and one. It's not easy to continue pounding the strike zone when you've given up three consecutive hits, but he has to trust that getting the ball down in the zone will get him an out. Three and one to him now. Hitters count all the way. Here it comes. And he jumps at a changeup, a swing and a miss. And he misses with it. Ball four. So that'll load the bases. And now he's really going to need to get a ground ball. Stepping up to the plate, Brendan Sanger. And he's a guy looking to break out in a big way. Hasn't been getting the results he or his club have been hoping for. The count now at two and one. From the stretch. Two and two. two 
sent on the ground out to second. And that is into right field. The base hit. One run scores. Throw won't get him. Up to the plate now, Connor Justice. And he'll take strike three called. And he needed that one badly on the mound. One away. Striding in, Kevin Maiton. He's got three hits in six tries for the series. He's fallen behind now, three and one. It's clear he just hasn't been able to find any rhythm out there. Pretty much unable to hit any of the spots. And now he's at three and one, and he's put him into another great hitting count. The three-two pitch. Popped him up. Cruz in foul ground. And he brings it in for the second out of the inning. So coming to the plate, Edwin Young. He did his part yesterday afternoon as he cashed in with three hits in the losing effort. Tries to change up on him there, but it's a ball two and one. Has to be a challenge pitch coming up here. He probably doesn't want to flirt with loading the bases. Hard hit ball to second. Throw on to first, and they're able to escape the monster inning as the side is retired. So now it'll be the four hole hitter, Narciso Crook. He had a couple of hits in yesterday's contest. Hey, we're still in the early stages in this one. They're only down by a couple of runs, but it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started. And a half swing here, but this is in there for a cold strike, too. Borderline pitch right there. But as a low ball hitter, you can live with that as long as the umpire doesn't give him north as well. Tyler Callahan will be next. Into the corner and slicing foul. Into the windup, ready with the payoff pitch. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Center fielder giving chase. He gets there and makes the play for the first out. Coming to the plate now, Tyler Callahan. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Bases are empty, one man out. High pop-up. But this will land untouched. He's going to be thinking about that pitch all night if he doesn't have a big game right here. Pulled his front shoulder and everything went with it. Now a swing and a miss. He struck him out. And it's two up, two down to start the second. So striding in, Chris Oakey. He'll work on keeping this top of the second alive. And this is low, ball two. Two and one. Well, we all know he's not the greatest threat with the bat up there. His numbers certainly aren't that pretty. But, hey, I give him credit. He's really working the count right here. Popped him up. Kruger is there. He makes the play, and that'll end the inning. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. Digging in now, Jack Kruger, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. The 1-1. One, one. He might still be thrown off from that first inning, guys. He got knocked around pretty good, and that can be hard to recover from mentally sometimes. And he gets him to pop it up on the right side of the infield. And he'll put this one away for the first out of the inning. Stepping into the box, Zane Gerwitz. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. Well, he got a good pitch to hit last time up. Looked for it up in the zone and didn't miss it. Those are the pitches you only get maybe once an AB, maybe once a game, maybe once a week. So he certainly capitalized on it last time. Hit hard on the ground a second, and that is through into right field for a single. How about it? And now, Roberto Baldacchi. Runner's going. And it's fouled away. Oh, 
and he can't catch up to the fastball as he swings and misses for the second out. Settling in now, Bo Wayne. One and two. Now a fastball awfully close, but he doesn't get the call. It's two and two now. Well, two straight fastballs inside haven't put him away. So now it'll be interesting to see what he turns to. Count full, three balls and two strikes. And he misses here for ball four. Already two walks surrendered in his first couple of innings of work. So stepping in, Jordan Zimmerman. He drew a walk his first time up. The one-two is a wave and a miss. He struck him out. All set for the start of the inning. Stepping in, Jamison Hanna. Pulled toward right center field. Center fielder giving chase. It's down for an extra base hit as they have their first hit of the contest. And he is in to third with a leadoff triple. The right fielder, Michael. Standing in now, Michael Beltre. Now a curveball knocked down at home plate. But it won't skip away far enough for the runner to advance. And this is swung on and missed. Five quick strikeouts now, and that's your first out of the inning. Batting done. Now the with the plate, base. Charles Cruz. Cruz. The 1 1 home. Big sweeping breaking ball right there. Good pitch. But if he wants to get him to swing at it, he'll have to bring it in a little bit closer to the strike zone. And that's upstairs running the count to three and one. Everyone in the ballpark knows what the pitcher's intentions are in this situation. Great job at the plate to lay off a tough pitch in a good spot. Now a swing and a fly ball. And no one will track it down. Hit out towards second. Throw to first is in time, but meanwhile, the runner is in to score. So the plate now is the designated hitter, TJ Friedel. He'll try and start things over now with the bases empty and two away following the RBI ground ball. Fastball just inside. He's fallen behind now, three and one. Now a fastball gets the upper part of the zone for strike two. A bouncer up the middle. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. Bottom of the third now. Now at the plate, Brendan Sanger coming off the clutch two-run single his last time up. Yeah, guys, everyone knows he's been slumping. Dan, you can certainly attest to this, only amassing a solid one hit in your entire career. But pressure's off now. Maybe he gets hot. Into the windup, here's the 2-1 and one pitch. And he fires a fastball now for a called strike two. Hit hard on the ground at first. And a reach to his backhand, but he can't come up with it, and the leadoff man's aboard. The batter, number seven, designated hitter, Carter. At the plate, yes. Connor Justice takes this the other way to right. Beltre is there, and he'll bring this one in. Digging in for his second at-bat, Kevin Maiton. His last at-bat didn't go his way as he popped out in foul territory. Yeah, this one's going to upset him for a little bit. You make the pitcher work the way he did right there, and that's the end result. That one sticks with you for a while. Boy, the curveball just hasn't been there this afternoon. 
And that's by him into right field for a base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. So now to the plate, Edwin Young offered at and missed. Here's the it's there in plenty of time. He's out trying to steal third as they get the lead runner here. Heading out towards shallow right. Beltre is there, makes the catch, and the side is retired. Leading off the inning, Jose Garcia. And they'll need him to get something going here. Things not looking very good so far in this one, but we're still in the middle innings. They're down by a couple of runs, and this would be the right place and the right time to get something going. The last thing they want to do is to try to come from behind and win this one in the eighth or ninth inning. Lifted down the line and left. And this will not be caught. It's a foul ball. And he lays off there, ball four. So the leadoff man is on here to begin stanza number four. The third baseman, number Stepping in, Reese Hines. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. 50th pitch of the game on its way. Boy, not exactly what you'd like as a pitcher. One of the keys is to minimize your pitches, attack the strike zone early, a lot of deep counts, and working himself into a lot of trouble. Ball even at 2 and 2. From the belt, the pitch down the third baseline. But a foul ball as it holds it two and two. Again, another foul ball. Three to one is our score here in inning number four. Got him. So digging in now, Narciso Crook. He flew About out in his last at bat. Narciso Crook. Hit hard to third. One there. Relay to first in time. And just like that, this side is retired. Riding into the box, Jack Kruger. He popped out in his first trip. Yeah, I don't mind him trying to drive the ball in the air, but he can't collapse the backside, and that's exactly what he did in his last at bat. Look for him to stay a little taller and keep that upper half a little bit more over him. One thing that can nag at you as a pitcher is having to work really hard to get a guy that you think you should be able to cruise right through. He's not known for his offensive prowess, but he's putting together a real nice at bat here. Ready for another shot now. Zane Gerwitz. He steps in off a base hit in his last at bat. Pulls this one in the air out to left. Crook is in his tracks now as he makes the catch for out number two. Ready once again. Roberto Baldacchini. A hit in two tries for him so far. Baldacchini. The one two. Swing and a ball hit softly on the ground. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. Digging in, Tyler Callahan comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. And he lays off, so it's full now, 3 and 2. Yanked on the ground down the line. But this will get foul, so they'll do it again. Three and two. And a fastball swung on and missed as they set him down for the second time here tonight. Now batting, now batting Chris Oakey. Over one after a pop out in foul territory his first time through. Two and one. Ground ball sent back up the middle. He's got it. Throw gets him, two down. At 
at the plate, Jamison Hanna. Tries to go the other way as this is in the air to left field. Oh, and this kicks right off of him. Throw into second. The tag, and they'll get him at second. And with that, the side is retired. Wyatt Strahan, a right-handed reliever, standing 6-3, gets the ball now out of the bullpen. Wyatt Strahan. Stepping in now, Bo Wang sent on the ground out to second. And that's through for another base hit. He'll make it two for two in this one. The third base hit. To the plate now, Jordan Zimmerman. Zimmerman. In the dirt here. And he'll rein it in as the count moves to one and two. So look now the pitch and he wasn't going to hit that one with an or the strikeout and there's one gone riding in once again Brendan Sanger two hits in two trips more than thus far and he lays off here a nice job it's ball four first and second now with one away Digging in once again, Connor Justice hit the ball pretty well in his last at bat, but it resulted in a line out. Yeah, pretty unlucky right there, Matty. This ball gets down. Let's see if they try to score. And they'll hold that runner at third as everybody moves up a base, and they're loaded with one away. The first base Blake now, Kevin Maiton, skied into straightaway right. Catch will be made here. Tagging is the runner from third. And they'll extend their lead even further as the runs in to score from third. And it's a four to one game. Stepping up now, Edwin Young. And we'll see what he can do here with a pair of runners on base and two gone here in the fifth. The two one home. And he popped him up back into foul territory behind first. But this will land untouched. He's set. Here's the 2 2. Grounded weakly toward third. On to first, and that'll do it as they manage to not let this inning get out of hand. Into the box now. Michael Beltre looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at bat. Sometimes you just got to tip your cap to the guy on the mound. He's getting paid to try and get you out as well. Anytime it gets up there north of seven, eight pitch ABs, sometimes it just comes down to pure execution. Let's see if he makes the adjustment right here. The bat. The first baseman. Into the box now, Charles Cruz. And he comes back with a fastball, one and two now. Popped him up. Kruger has a play, one away. So striding forward now, TJ Friedel. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. Here now the 2-2. Gets him looking at the knees for the strikeout. Stepping in and ready for another now shot. Back. Jose Garcia. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Garcia. He's going, he's Runner going. goes. Swing and a ground ball to third. Throw in time and the side is retired. Out of the plate, Jack Kruger. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. Two and two count. Here it comes. You can pretty much book it that a fastball's coming. A challenge fastball right here. He cannot allow the nine-hole hitter to get on base with the top of the order. Room. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the first out. Number 19, second baseman. 
The one two. And he takes ball three, so it's a full count now. Grounded back up the middle. And a diving effort there, but it'll come up empty. It's a base hit. In now, Roberto Baldacchini. Swing and a flare hit toward right. In there, a base hit. And he's safe. The center fielder, number three. Bo. Standing in now, Bo Wayne. Hit down the third baseline. And this gets past him at third as it hugs the line. A fair ball. And they'll add one more to the lead. It's now a 5-1 to one ball game. Stepping in now, Jordan Zimmerman lifted in the air out to center field. Catch made in center. Here comes the runner from third. And they'll extend their lead even further as the run from third is in to score. Aaron Fosses is going to come on in relief as he'll be making his 20th appearance of the season. Brendan Sanger will be his first assignment upon entering as he'll bat with the runner in scoring position here and two away. The 1-1 one -one is swung on and missed and that's strike two. Now just trying to freeze him with the fastball there. Pretty close. It's two and two. As a look, now the pitch. And look out as that one ran in and got him. Coming to the plate now, Connor Justice. Last time through was a base hit. Two down runners at first and second. And he lays off for a ball, two and one. Fosses, a 27-year-old, he throws a four-seam fastball, a slider, a changeup, and a two-seam fastball. Three and one to him now. Looking to minimize the damage here. And that pitch misses for ball four. So some intrigue now as the bases are loaded here with two away. The one-two. Swing and a miss as he chased with two strikes, and that will retire the side. Seventh inning ready to roll. Into the box now, Reese Hines. He was punched out looking at strike three last time through. A one and one count. Here's the pitch, and he fouls this one off. The one two. Misses ball two. Fastball didn't miss by much, and it's a full count now. Three and two. Sky down the left field line. Left fielder giving chase, and he makes the catch in the corner. Now at the now plate, back. Narciso Let's Crook. Go. It's been an 0-for-2 effort for him to this point. Crook. A ball and two strikes now. The 1-2. Swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. At the plate, Tyler back. Callahan. And he's likely just trying to put one in play here. 0 for 2 with a pair of strikeouts thus far. A shot to first base and caught there to end the inning. Ready for another chance? Edwin Yon. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. Now the 2-1 pitch. 
You do not want to walk the eight-hole hitter. It just opens up so many options. Do we bunt them over to second with the nine-hole hitter? Do we try and play for that big rally with the top of the order coming up? This is a huge pitch. You can't allow this guy to walk. Had to sit back on the changeup, and he did a good job to get the bat on that one. Hey, three foul balls in a row right here, searching for that put away stuff. And that misses ball four. It's a leadoff walk to start the home seven. Now at the plate, Jack Kruger. He went down on strikes last time up. Yeah, and kind of shocked he got blown away with a fastball. You could tell he was late on that one. And we'll see if he tries to cheat to something this A.B. Two balls and a strike now. Now the 2-1 pitch. Nope, that's a ball. This situation right here reminds me of sitting on the bench talking to John Smoltz, Hall of Famer. He would always say, even though the situation looked bad, a pitcher is in. Swing, high drive, left field and deep. Gone! At the plate, Zane Gerwitz. And there's ball two now. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Right fielder giving chase. And he tracks it down. Nice play for the first down. Digging in, Roberto Baldacchino. On the night, he's two for four with a pair of singles. Still only one out in the inning. They have him looking awfully confused up there right now. It's one and two. And I really don't know how you swing at that. He must have had his mind up. He was going to swing as soon as the ball came out of the pitcher's hand. And now a slider in there for a call. Third strike. And there are two gone now. Weak roller right side. Reined in. And he'll step on the bag himself. And the inning is over. been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Number 68. Standing in, Chris Oakey. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. It doesn't look very promising so far in this one as we move into the later innings. Down by a bundle, it's time to get some base runners and hopefully a long ball to get them back into this one. Throw on to first in time, so the leadoff man is set down to open up inning number eight. Standing in, Jamison Hanna, two for two with a triple on his batting line to this point. To two balls and two strikes now. Fouled off. Uh, two, two, one more time. Making him sweat out there. The seventh pitch coming up. Line drive, and that's a base hit in the center field. Now back to right field, Michael Beltre. At the plate now, Michael Beltre. Well above the letters with the fastball that time. Ball, but he's losing it a bit here to three and one now. Charles Cruz is on deck. And he lays off here. A nice job. It's ball four. First and second now with one away. Now batter. Now in the box, Charles Cruz. In his last at bat, he popped out in foul ground. Yeah, Matt, he's got to make an adjustment right here. His swing definitely broke down, dropped his back shoulder, and thus the result was a terrible pop-up foul. Hey, lots of guys get too aggressive in a spot like this, but he's done a nice job of gaining some count leverage. Look for him to put the ball and play hard. Hit weakly back to the mound. Fielded cleanly. The second for one. Return throw is in time. How about that? They do turn two, and it gets him out of the inning.
So here's the cleanup hitter, Jordan Zimmerman, 0 for 2 for him to this point. Swing and a liner. But quick reactions at the hot corner take away a hit, and there's one gone. The right fielder, four. Ready now, Brendan Sanger. Right Already two for two. He'll look Sanger. to add on right here. Turned on, but it's wide of first and foul. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Left fielder giving chase. He tracks it down and makes the play to record the second out. Striding forward now is the D.H. Connor Justice. He's got a hit in three at-bats to this point. The 1-1 home. Pulled high in the air out to left field. And eight innings have come and gone now as the inning is over. Now back to the top of the lineup. Stepping in, T.J. Friedel. 0 for 3 with a couple of strikeouts for him to this point in the ballgame. Hit in the air down the right field line. But this will wind up being a foul ball. The one two. Line to the right side. But that's a foul ball. Now another one two. And oh we can't get out of the way of that one. So the leadoff man will be on to open the frame. Stepping into the box, Jose Garcia. He was a ground out victim last time up. Yeah, Matty, expect this pitcher to try and get the same result as his last at bat right here. The double play is in order. Anything on the ground, the way this defense is, they could certainly roll too. So we got him swinging. Jose Garcia becomes the first out in the ninth inning. Now the payoff pitch home. And he lays off here. A nice job. It's ball four. First and second now with one away. Digging in to try it again. Narciso Crook. He could really use a knock here. 0 for 3 in the game so far. High in the air out to center field. And this will get over the wall in fact. So just the one run will be allowed to score. Simon Matthews answers the call from dugout as he'll try to record the final two outs of this one. To the plate now, Tyler Callahan. Outside, two and one. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Young has it, and I'd be surprised if they send the runner. And both runners have to hold where they are, so call it a missed opportunity with two gone now. Digging in, Chris Oki. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. Now the 2 1. He's high and outside for a ball. Hard hit ball to second. Oh, look at the sliding stop. What a play. And just like that, this one is over. Well, this game had its moments, but it got out of hand pretty quick. Always nice when you can post to a six-run win. Save your closer for another day and let everyone in on the action. Eight to two tonight's final. The Rocket City Trash Pandas posted a three-run first to propel them to the win. Michael Santos takes the win on the mound, his second of the year. Packy Naughton was only able to work four innings as he takes the loss. So that'll put a wrap on things here this evening. From my partners Dan Plezak and Mark DeRosa, I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a special presentation of MLB The Show. For more, follow us on Twitter at MLB The Show.
for the victorious crash test. Eight runs on 13 hits. No errors. They left 10 men on base. For the lookout, two runs on five hits. No errors. They left six men on base. Time of the ball game, three hours and ten 